Uh, well, I'm going to tell you about our seniors. We're proud of them. Uh, they worked awfully hard. They've done a great job for us. We've been fortunate in that we have some very skilled senior wrestlers that have been with us, some of them for several years. Uh, first one, Dakota Hines. I wish we had them for several years. It's been a wonderful addition to the team. Uh, Dakota's parents, Tracy Powell and John Powell of Hartford, Kentucky. He's been wrestling for two years, and both years he's been varsity. His season record is 25 and 12. His career record of two years is 43 and 24. Uh, some of his extracurricular activities besides wrestling, he's in the FBLA, and he's the secretary of Skills USA. Uh, for his plans after graduation and after wrestling season, uh, college, he wants to go to OCC for two years of pre ministry and University of Quebec or Western Protection University for his last two years. And after college, he wants to work somewhere as a dental hygienist. Uh, Ask what he would like to say to thank or to recognize. Uh, the brother wants to thank his mom and his dad and all of his family for supporting him throughout all of his wrestling uh, career and for his decisions throughout high school. And he also like to thank some of his closest teammates, including Taylor Sapp, Chase Arnold, DJ Miller, Lane Brown, Josh McCoy, Zach Harris, and Luke Shaver for, he says, pushing me my limits on the mat and making me the best wrestler I can be. Let's have a hand for our brother. <laughs> our next season, uh, senior is B.J. Miller. He is the uh, son of Brian and Amy Miller of Beaverdam. Uh, B.J. has wrestled for six years. He's been in varsity five years. This year he's undefeated. Season record of 24 and 0. Has a career record of 141 and 49. Uh, some of uh, the rest of the awards and recognition, he put three times state qualifier and uh, a bump up uh, last year in, in, in the region. Um, he got the ball out uh, because he's done so much work in that. So I'm going to add that he's been first place in very many tournaments over the years, and he, including this year, he was uh, named the outstanding wrestler in one of our tournaments. Uh, on his other extracurricular activities and awards, uh, He's been, he played uh, three years of RC tennis. He's been in the Pep Club and OC Gut Free. And uh, BJ has been the class president uh, of his class for all four years of high school. So that's quite an accomplishment. Uh, plans after wrestling, after graduation. He wants to enjoy the rest of the school year and get fatted up. After, he's a hungry guy. After graduation, Says I'm going to have as much fun as possible this summer and then I'm going to be headed to the University of Kentucky to major in uh, secondary education and social studies. Uh, what I would like to say uh, is that this sport has been a great aspect of my life for six years now. It's changed both mine and my parents' life. And they've had to sacrifice a lot more to support me for me. And for that I thank them so much. And he says I love you. I'd like to say a very special thank you to Coach Nolan and Coach Nick for not only helping me in wrestling, but also helping me to become a better person. I see both of you as second dads, and I know that I can always rely on you. I thank you for all you've done in my life, and I love you. I also like to thank all the assistant coaches and boosters who wouldn't have what we have without all of you. And that is the truth. Um, I also owe a very special thank you to Chase Boone. God knows I wouldn't be where I am today in the sport of wrestling without it. Chase taught me a lot of what I know. And more than that, showed me that uh, through hard work you can, you can accomplish anything. And last but not least, he wants to thank God for blessing him with not only the skills that he has, but also the great many opportunities to spread uh, the word. Uh, to his fellow seniors, he says, uh, I love you guys, and I'm proud to be standing by tonight. And to the other classmen, just stick it out and work your hardest uh, for the rest of your time here. And I will miss all of you. Hey, you go. And now, Blake Brown, son of Brad and Kelly Brown of Harvard, Kentucky. Blake wrestled four years for us, three years that he's in varsity. This year he's 27 and 13, with a career record of 79 and 52. Uh, wrestling awards recognition, or excuse me, 
awards recognition. You see, first team academic All State Award last year. He's one uh, of our team captains this year. Some of his extracurricular activities, he volunteered as uh, volunteers at the Gutter Care. He was uh, on the academic team for my school this freshman year. For plans after graduation, plans on attending Western Tech University of all special and majoring in mathematics. What I'd like to say is that we'd like to thank his mom and dad for spending their Saturdays and waiting, watching them compete. He says, I also want to thank Jacob Bennett and his family for introducing me to the sport and supporting me as well. And lastly, I want to thank my teammates and coaches for being my wrestling family and helping me become who I am today. Ray Brown, thank you. And now, Zachary Gunner Ferris. He's the son of Rodney and Beth Ferris of Centerdown, Kentucky. Uh, he's wrestled five years. He's been varsity four of those. This season, he's 21 and, excuse me, 29 and 1 with a career record of 142 and 26. Uh, for wrestling awards and recognition, he's freshman year, he's second in the region and first region in the sophomore year, second again uh, in the junior year, and third in the state year, which is part of an accomplishment. He was chosen to wrestle over some of the two national dual tournaments this past summer, so he's represented Ohio County nationally. Um, some of his other uh, extracurricular activities, and he's in Skills USA, he served as treasurer for two years, the OCW3, he served as president, he's active as volunteer for Children's Church Ministry at Liberty Lighthouse. For plans for after wrestling, he's planning to continue to wrestle for St. Catherine in Bardstown and earned his degree in social studies and science as a teacher at the middle school level. Uh, what I'd like to say, I'd like to thank God for everything that he's done for me. He says I'd like to thank my parents, my brother, Drew, my family, my, my church family for believing in me, and my coaches, my team for supporting and also their friendships that they've made over the years. Zach Ferris. And last but certainly not least, Luke Shaver. He is the son of Clyde and Angie from Sacramento, Kentucky. He's wrestled for three years and he's been in all three. He has a season record of 27 and 2, a career record of 81 and 18. Uh, he's been academic all state 2012 through 2014 and two years of state qualifier in wrestling. Other uh, extracurricular activities, uh, three year varsity football. Beta Club, Pep Club, OC Club 3, he's in the student council, and he's a uh, class secretary. For his plans for after wrestling and after graduation, those plans are to graduate in May and go to college for wrestling and football. Plans to major in world history with minor in business communications. Many plans to come back to Ohio County and teach and coach. And we will be a very good one. Uh, he would like to thank his parents for supporting him and loving him. And thanks to Nathan, Matt, and Rebecca for helping me a big one today. I love you guys. And thanks to the school and faculty for the support of, for the wrestling team. Thank you to our visitors who put in countless hours raising money for us to have nice moments and sing And then lastly, thank you to my coaches who spent hours away from their families to teach boys sport of wrestling. David Miller, Robert, Robert Nicodemus. Michael Brown, Damon Barnes, Jacob Mason, and Eddie Childers, and others who have come in and helped the team. I couldn't pick, pick better coaches. I love you guys and thank you. Good shape. And in addition to the flowers for the parents of the moms, uh, the visitors also made these nice banners up here, which will be presented to boys at uh, the banquet this year. Up to my left, to your right. So thank you to the business. I think they're deserving of a little applause, recognition. So I think that's it. Get ready to rumble.